I'm John Kramer, this is Political Foobar, and today, the chicken's afoot! Political Foobar! Now, if Sherlock Holmes was running around today, it's possible that someone might have asked him about the curious case of the Chick-fil-A boycott. Now, Mr. Holmes, is there anything about that boycott to which you would wish to draw our attention? Yes, to the curious case of the Amazon.com boycott. But there was no Amazon.com boycott. That was the curious incident. Well, of course, you all know about the Chick-fil-A controversy currently cooking in political kitchens everywhere. The company's president, Dan Cathy, made some anti-gay marriage remarks so that now liberals like myself are essentially forbidden to eat in Chick-fil-A's while Fox News viewers are stuffing their faces with chicken sandwiches and waffle fries. But where is the boycott of Amazon.com? I mean, it turns out that at the same time the Chick-fil-A goofiness was boiling over, Jeff Bezos, the founder and CEO of Amazon.com, was making a $2.5 million donation from himself and his wife to support Referendum 74 in Washington State to legalize gay marriage there. So again, where was the boycott? I mean, one guy quotes scripture to cast gay marriage in a sinful light and gets hammered for it, while the other guy puts his money where his mouth is in support of gay marriage and no one takes notice. Now, I'm not exactly sure why this is, but if I had to guess, I'd say it was because Americans are pretty damn lazy. I mean, come on, how hard is it not to buy a chicken sandwich or to actually buy a chicken sandwich to show your hostility towards gay and lesbian Americans? But not using Amazon? Well, that's a whole lot tougher since it's now the world's largest online retailer. Or, in the end, is it because people get a lot more riled up when you do or say something to put people down, like Dan Cathy did, instead of doing something to help lift others up, as Jeff Bezos did? So what do you think? Thanks for watching. Please give the video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button up above. And I'll see you back here next time. Thank <laughs> you.